Wendy. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm reading the scripture for this Sunday. How are you reading the scripture? We're sitting in the dark. Mean? Oh, wow. It did get dark really quickly. What time is it? Well, um, it gets to dark very quickly nowadays. Yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't even realize how dark it got how quickly. But it's huh? kind of interesting because I've been reading the scripture for Sunday and I've listened to these words. By the tender mercy of our God, the dawn from on high will break upon us to give light to those who sit in darkness and in the shadow of death, to guide our feet into the way of peace. Mm. Mm. You know, you know, those are powerful words that Zachariah has to say because we oftentimes think of this season between Thanksgiving and Christmas, the Advent season as a time of as a time of light and celebration. Yeah, and, but it's our darkest time of the year. Well, it is our darkest time of the year for many people. Uh, not just the darkest time of the year outside, but the darkest time of the year in, in their lives because they're grieving loss. Yeah. And, and they're wanting that light to shine. They're longing for just a word of hope. Yeah. But you know what's interesting is that I find that when I'm in darkness, when I can lean into it, that that's when the light catches my eyes the most mm. and it draws me in. And so I wonder if this is a good season, this time of darkness, to have this message mm. that God sends to us. A message that salvation has come and our light has come. And it might surprise us and be in a new way, but it, it's there for us. And, and God's bringing it to us. And, and it's maybe in those times that we lean into that darkness in our own life that that bright, the light shines the brightest, and this season has so much more meaning to it. Yeah, the reason that we are longing and grieving is because we've had so many special memories in this time, and that light has shined for us. Mm. And that light that God gives, it's going to shine forever. Mm. And that's really the hope that we have. It is the hope that we have. Well, join us this Sunday at All Shepherds or St. Mark's as we worship together. And we're longing for that light and that promise that comes into the darkest part of our lives. The hope that is of, that comes in Jesus Christ. Amen.